The goal that you'll watch over and over from last week's win against Sporting Kansas City was Sebastian Blanco's long-distance rocket to open the scoring for the Timbers. But there were two other Timbers goals in that match, and the work for those started in the Timbers' defensive half. In this month's Axes and O's presented by Oric Solar, Ross Smith breaks down a couple of the goals that sent the Portland Timbers to MLS Cup. As we give a little love to the second and third goal, I want you to pay attention to the movement, the timing of the runs, and the sheer quality the Timbers show to be able to score the goals. Just when Bill Tuiloma is on the ball, as it's played into Jeremy and Bobasi, when the Timbers don't win it, this is such an important moment, getting the seconds, getting the ball on the deck, and trying to play out of pressure. There's your pressure. Circle two Kansas City players, third, fourth, and a fifth. All that pressure to try and smother the Timbers to not allow them to play out of danger. But the Timbers, with their quality, their movement, they're able to find a way through. And when the ball comes into Valeri here, he picks up his head. He's needing support. And you'll see that come by way of a Bovisi who comes in and he has a beautiful touch out of trouble. And he sees the overlapping run of Jorge Villafania. But just there, Blanco, he's looking to find his space now. And he's connected with the eyes with Villafania who's looking for him. Just pay attention to Bovisi and Valeri. They're not even in the picture right now, but of course they become a vital part pretty soon. The ball comes into Blanco, it's a lovely turn. And on that half turn, he picks his head up, and again, there's that contact in the eyes. An understanding of what one another wants to do. It's a lovely ball played over the top. Obovisi, he caresses it, nice, gets a vital second touch, but then there's Valeri for the finish. On to the third goal. This was the decider, this what broke the backs of Kansas City. So the ball is coming in from Graham Zuzzi. Just keep an eye on the two players here. And remember, this is the 99th minute. The tiredness in the legs, but the Timbers, they still have plenty of juice. Of course, Diego Chara here, who eventually gets on the ball. So as I let this play out, you see the ball comes into Chara, who has the composure to play into Blanco, gives it back to him. But again, if you're watching Valeri, he gets on his horse. And Zuzi doesn't have the juice to try and keep up. He doesn't have the energy. Valeri, he cuts across Zuzi. Two beautiful touches to off-balance Tim Melia. And balls in the back of the net. They're booking their plane ticket to Atlanta. We've been treated to some stunning goals so far in this playoffs. May it continue for one more match.